Hi everybody, to run the PLC we need 24 volt DC. I have DC power supply and I have DVP 14 SS2 relay type uh, PLC. You can see on the right side. On my PLC there is a SS um, input. Uh, I'm using uh, my PLC as a source mode. Uh, for source mode you need to give ground to SS. Now you can see DVPSS2 instruction sheet. Uh, you can look bit difference between transfer type and relay type. And input output configuration you can see the relay type uh, output C0 Y0, Y1, Y2 is connected to C0 and uh, output point wiring you can see the circuit. Uh, the PLC has got two modes one is sync mode, one is source mode. Uh, I'm, I will use in source mode uh, you, if you want to use input, if you want to give a uh, 24 volt DC to input, uh, if you want to use like this, you need to give SS to ground, connect SS to ground. As you see, uh, relay output circuit wiring title, we should give C0 and C1. Uh, positive voltage like 24 volt DC or 220 volt AC we can use. Uh, if we don't give C0 we can't see any voltage Y0 output. First we need to open Google and you can write Delta PS software and open the Delta's official websites to Dolan software. Uh, I'm using DVPSS2 series uh, Delta. We can click the software and submit. Uh, we can use VPL soft 2.46. We can download here. And after download, we should install VPR soft. I have already installed. I have already installed. And I, I will show you firstly simulation mode. How can we use? This is our editor for PS programming for ladder diagram. We can click new project here. Yes. Program title first program. We can choose PLC and PLC type from here. I'm using Slim SS2, not SS. SS2 and I will show later the settings. So the file name can be first pro. Click enter. This is our ledger diagram. This is instruction list mode. First program can be like normally open contact x0 first input of our PLC and we can use it directly to output coil Y0 like this. First we should uh, compile it from here. 
be compiled. The end is comes automatically. We can see on simulation mode here, simulator, we are opening simulator and we should click online mode. It is asking, do you want to launch current opens program to PLC? Yes. You can see the instruction list mode here. It's like assembly. And we should run the PLC because here in stop mode or PLC in simulator, we should run the PLC. Yes. Now we are running. And we can try to set on x0. You can see y0, the output is open. For example, if you used 24 volts, we should see 24 volts at y0. You can set off the, when we set off, you see the y0 is going down, 0 volt. This is simulation mode. We can go out direct from simulator. And now I'm plugging uh, my PLC to my laptop with USB uh, unit RS232 USB cable and you should look your computer manage if your device driver your COM port, Prolific USB to serial COM port in COM3, uh, it comes in Windows 10, it comes automatically and uh, we should choose a communication setting from here. We can use auto detect. Detecting communication port. My and we can. I open. Uh, I give power to my PLC and we should open communication setting. And we can use auto detect. SS two nine thousand six hundred protocol. The one bit is stop. I think. Mode is ASG. API setting is are OK. We can click OK, and you can look transfer stuff from here if you need something. And communication setting we used change PS type. We can change PS type from here. We are using SS2. If you choose wrongly the type you can't program your PLC you can send program to PLC and now uh, I will change a little I, we can use as a M memory 0 and you can use memory 1 2 3 more I'm adding row from here and M0 I will use M02 output why I am doing this because in uh, X, X0 is a physical uh, input we can't change on online mode from computer now I can compile you can say if you want program not now now we can just click online mode. Before online mode, we should send it 
to PLC. You can choose PLC password, something you don't need, you don't need right now. And directly, this is the warning is when PLC is running, write is forbidden. We should uh, stop the PLC to write program to PLC. Now we can say OK. Now we have program in our PLC and we can click online mode. We should run. Now you see the run and we can change something. When we try to set on the device address is or connected because of the physical input we can't change from in computer first we should change the program to see from computer we can use memory 0 to output y0 we can compile the program and we can uh, stop the first PLC and program to PLC and we can see on online mode from computer to see we should run the PLC now run we can set on the M0 and we can see the Y0 is output it's like a button when we push the button you can see the output from PLC you can close you can uh, listen the click voice from relay because my PLC is relay mode have there is two types of PLC one transistor and one re relay 